Nichen <laughs> Self-Help Society Island Cooperatives Eichen, a Vorhuts or Sonichia Duer. A new experiment in the highlands and islands of Scotland is attempting to help revive the region's economic fortunes and halt the decline in population. A number of community cooperatives have been sponsored by the Highlands and Islands Development Board, mainly in the Western Isles. Each cooperative is run by a committee of unpaid local residents and aims to be financially independent after about five years. The Development Board assists the cooperatives financially in the early stages and contributes technical expertise and advice where required. How did the idea come about? We spoke to the Board's Senior Social Development Officer, Bob Storey. We first saw the community cooperative working in the west of Ireland, in the Gaelic-speaking areas, and we were impressed by what they were doing there. Uh, these organizations, open to all members of the, the community, were appealing, obviously, uh, in terms of what they could do for culturally distinctive areas, but also on giving material advantage to, to the members. And it occurred to us that it would be the kind of thing that might work in some of our marginal areas, essentially because we feel that development of a kind that comes from within the community is of longer lasting benefit. That's certainly been our experience than development brought in from outside to these areas. One of the cooperatives is on the island of Eriske. Eriske is in the Western Isles and had to rely heavily on the neighboring island of South Uist for its supplies until the cooperative started. The Gallic word kohumen, meaning fellowship, is used to describe the community cooperatives. Eriske is one of the smaller islands and its population consists of about 200 people who are mainly Gallic speaking and Catholic. It's basically a fishing community. Virtually every family has bought a 50-pound share in the island's cooperative, and several have bought more. 
But no matter how large the shareholding, each shareholder has just one vote in the Kahuman's affairs. Under the scheme, all the shareholders must be local residents, and up to an agreed limit, the development board makes a grant which matches the initial subscriptions on a pound-for-pound -pound basis. The cooperative's first project was to provide a shop for the island. The idea is that this should provide a solid financial foundation for any future projects. How did it all start? We asked Konyak McLean, a field officer from the development board. The program for community cooperatives began in November 77, but it wasn't until June 78 that work began on Eriscape. And we eventually arranged for a meeting of the community to discuss the question of a shop, having discovered that a private entrepreneur had declined to take up the offer to build a shop on the island. There had been a degree of skepticism by community leaders in the past, but eventually they felt that there was no alternative but to build a shop of their own. And the community cooperative program seemed to be the best answer. And I think as much as because of the fact that a shop was going to be built, people subscribed very quickly. Um, a target of 7,500 was set, and within three days, half of that was, a, was subscribed. And uh, we had no difficulty whatsoever in raising the money. The development board contributed a further £7,500, and the combined sum of £15,000 made up the initial working capital. For up to five years, the board also assists with certain administrative expenses, such as the salary of the manager appointed by the Kirchhoman, Ian McInnes. The shop was opened in March of 1980 to provide a service for the community. There is a shop on the island just now, shop come post office, but the, the shop part of it has been run down over several years. It meant that the people, when they were buying goods into the island, even basic goods, they had to bring them over from the south of the mainland. These goods were formerly brought over by the island's housewives on a rotor basis. What difference has the shop made? The benefits have been marvellous, really. We're now able to go into the shop and buy just exactly what we want, when we want. Um, although the distribution service we had in the hall, it, you know, we did a marvellous, the women did a marvellous job, but nevertheless, we still had to travel backwards and forwards to use for the bulk of our buying. Um, and sometimes the weather wasn't really, you know, it wasn't all that desirable. We had to travel in really bad weather, so therefore the shop has cut out all this travelling backwards and forwards. The secretary of the cooperative is the island's priest, Father Macmillan. I don't want to separate my work too much from, as it were, the priesthood and work with the Kokoman. I think it's part of the, the general work of a priest here to be involved with the, the people, not just in their spiritual lives, but in their material needs as well. The management committee is made up of uh, chairman and secretary and uh, nine other members. The manager of the shop, the Kokoman itself, comes into the meetings and of also uh, Cunyach McLean, who's the uh, representative of the HIDB. They don't have uh, voting powers on the management committee, but they can give advice and recommendations. Another project is concerned with the marketing of high-quality jerseys made on the island. The Eriske jersey is a unique garment. It's seamless and the patterns used in it reflect the island life. The tradition is that mothers hand on the patterns to daughters, and in that way the patterns have been maintained throughout the years. When the Kohoman was formed, we took upon ourselves to mark the jerseys for them, provide, we provide them with the rules, get orders for them, and uh, sell them. The Kohoman is at the present time negotiating to buy two houses the idea is to renovate these houses and make them available for people to come to the island as, in a self-catering holiday form. There are various possibilities of what people can do when they come here. We would like to provide facilities for, for example, sea fishing, perhaps utilizing the Eriski pony on the island, using them for pony trekking. Fishing is the island's main industry and employs most of the men of working age. 
The fleet is away all week and returns only at the weekend. The Ariske Fishermen's Cooperative is a member of the Kohoman, and ultimately the Kohoman plans to provide all the supplies needed by the fishing fleet. The main involvement at the present time is to provide a diesel station for the fishing boats. The foundations are in place and it's just a matter of bringing the tank over and siting it there. The Cohomans Management Committee, which is elected by the shareholders, meets regularly to assess progress made and to discuss possible future projects. Uh, the next item on the agenda is to do with the minibus. As well as the community minibus, there are ideas for fish processing and for providing a new community hall for the island. For such schemes, further financial assistance may be obtained from the Highlands and Islands Development Board. All businesses in the region may apply for loans or grants for specific projects. How is the Eriske Cooperative placed at the moment? Our turnover at the present time is about £150,000. I think that's excellent from the island's point of view in that that money has been retained in the island. It's money earned by the islanders. And instead of going to you as far to the mainland, it's been retained within the island and circulating on there. Another community cooperative is on the island of Harris, where the majority of the population is Protestant. The basic principles and constitution of the Harris cooperative are the same as for Eriske, but there are some differences. Harris is much larger and has a population of over 2,000, ten times as big. The basis of the Harris Cooperative's projects are divided between the two main population centres. First, Tavert, the main port and ferry terminal. It's a journey of over 20 miles from there to Leverborough, where the headquarters of the Kohuman is based. Here, once again, the shareholders, who in this instance have a minimum shareholding of £25, run the Kohuman. As with Eriske, residents become shareholders not in the expectation of quick dividends, but because of a common desire to contribute towards the well-being of the community as a whole. And during the first few years of operation, any profits are to be ploughed back into the cooperative's projects rather than distributed to the shareholders. We asked one shareholder if she felt it worthwhile to contribute. Well, I became a shareholder because for too long, I think we have been dependent on outside capital and outside influences. And you heard far too often they should do something about em unemployment. And at last, it was a case of we were going to do something. And it was local capital, which meant that people who really knew the problems could get along and collect the money and try and do something. And it was from inside the community, which I thought would uh, generate a certain confidence in the community. The Kohoman's manager is Barry Dobson. I took up my position as manager in December 1979, that's some 18, 19 months ago. And since that date, we have nine projects off the ground. The very first project was the coal supply service which we run. Now, this is not a new business, but the man who was running the business decided that he had other business interests which he wished to pursue and uh, wanted to give up the coal business. At the same time, Kokoman came into being, and we saw this as being an ideal opportunity to get our business off the ground. In other words, we were, from the very word go, we were performing the sort of service that we were set up for. We were providing a benefit for the community, uh, and we were retaining um, people in jobs. At the same time, February 1980, we also took over the management and agency services for the Harris Craft Guild. Now, the Harris Craft Guild is a well-established cooperative, a craft workers cooperative. Now, it's purely non-profit making. It's purely and simply a vehicle for people who uh, do craft work in their own homes to market their produce. Barry Dobson is the secretary of the guild and obtains orders for the work at the principal trade fairs. These orders are given to the craft workers who make the goods mainly during the winter months. The Kohoman then packs the goods, dispatches them, and sends out the bills. When the money comes in, it's paid over to the Harris Craft Guild, and the Kohoman receives a fee for its services. The third project that uh, 
that came into being was really the building that we're in now, the building we call Anclacken. This building was built by the Highlands and Islands Development Board. Um, the construction was started some two years ago, and it was coincidental that at the time that we were looking for suitable premises as a, a base for or a, a headquarters, a base to work from, the Highlands and Islands Development Board were also looking for, for a suitable tenant or body who were willing to take on responsibility for this building. We saw this as an ideal outlet uh, or an ideal base for our activities, and also, again, it would help us fulfill one of our basic functions, and that is to provi provide employment and services. There was nothing at this part of the island at all for, uh, for tourists. There wasn't even anywhere for tourists to get a cup of tea. So we took this building in May of 1980, and the first uh, part of the building open was the tea room. So we have capacity for 40 people, and we provide home baking and hot snacks, fresh tea and coffee. Now that. That, that is an, a project in its own right, because that is run entirely by Cocom and Nahera. Downstairs, we have a craft shop that does sell nothing but high-quality Scottish crafts. Everything we have in the shop is made in Scotland, and an awful lot of it on the island of Paris itself and the surrounding islands. Now, that shop uh, is a project that is run in conjunction with the Harris Craft Guild. In other words, it's also a, a prime outlet for the craft workers of the Harris Craft Guild for, for their um, produce. Moving upstairs, we come into the exhibition area, and we really do have a very nice exhibition here, which tells the story of Harris Tweed from the moment the wool comes off the back of the sheep, all of the various processes it goes through until it comes off the loom at the other end in the form of traditional Harris Tweed. Now, speaking of the loom, we have a weaver who is here, work, he works here all year round, during the tourist season, he gives demonstrations of weaving and answers questions that the, uh, the tourists ask. Um, and of course, we have text and we have script on the panels where people can also get the historical and social background to Harris Tween. Outside the tourist season, we run a ship's chandlery business. So we've taken over that responsibility and we can supply wet weather clothing, small catering needs for the small boats, ropes, paints, in fact, all of the things one normally associates with the inshore fishing industry. From my point of view as a, as a fisherman, I've also taken over the running of the local fishermen's co-op, which uh, is a great benefit to us, stocks a lot of stuff, which we couldn't otherwise get without going to Stornoway or sending off for it, as we, as we used to do. We also have a horticultural project. Now, this um, horticultural project is the growing of seeds to plants for sale and also the, on, the, the growing on of those plants for, to full-grown vegetables for sale. James Downey, the Cohomans chairman, is particularly concerned with this project. Well, this is land that hasn't been used for some 40 years. Uh, it is potentially productive land, and this is our first year here. As you see, there's a lot to be done still, but we're growing some 3,000 cabbages, potatoes, turnips here. The object, really, is to uh, show people that a wide range of vegetables can be grown over here, rather than importing rather stale vegetables from the mainland. The people we do have working on the horticultural project, we have, um, under the auspices of Manpower Services Commission, in other words, they come uh, under the scheme known as community enterprise projects. Moving from the horticulture back into this building again, we brought the last part of this building into operation in April of this year. And down in the workshop, we're producing polyester resin replicas. The workshop provides employment for three people. A wide range of replicas is produced, and for this project, the Kuhuman is in effect acting as a subcontractor for a company in Sirencester. Most of the output is sent there, but some items are stocked in the shop. One product is a Viking war game, which in Europe, at least, is believed to be older than chess. And last but not least, building materials. And we've only just recently moved into this project, and the building materials store has been there for an awful lot of years. It was run and owned by the Department of Agriculture and Fisheries for Scotland and they've very nearly been there as long as anyone can remember. But in December of 1980, uh, in 
the fact that the Department of Agriculture and Fisheries of Scotland closed down all of the building material stores. O'Common felt that this was an area that we should be in because it was a basic service and benefit to the community. That if anyone wanted a bag of cement or a handful of nails or a piece of timber, without that store, it meant a 40 to 60 mile drive to Stornoway. So we felt, as I say, that this was really one of the basic areas. And again, it brought back the two jobs that had been lost when the Department of Agriculture and Fisheries closed the store down. But we're now talking about uh, some nine, ten projects in 18 months, which I'm sure you'll appreciate is a long way in a very short space of time. We're still very much in our infancy, but results are encouraging. We're on target. We're where we want to be. As well as receiving financial help from the Development Board, the Kuchuman is helped by the Board's local field officer, Agnes Gillies. My job in itself is one of liaison between the cooperatives the management committees, the manager, and the Highland Board principally. But also, we are supposed to have what is called a catalytic role, one whereby we work with the people on the management committees primarily, uh, trying to stimulate them to work amongst themselves within their communities to take up new ideas and to use a cooperative structure to develop these ideas. At present, we've got about 10 community cooperatives, eight in the Western Isles, one on the mainland, and one in Orkney. They're employing oh, about 30 people full time, and uh, about twice that in uh, part time jobs. Um, their fortunes are fairly mixed. Some are broadly on target for profitability, others have had quite formidable setbacks. But that's fairly typical of small business development at this kind of early stage. And it's really not possible to judge at this stage just what their profitability prospects are. But I think we have to look wider than this uh, in terms of the wider development impact of something like this in a local community. We can see that local knowledge of resources be is being used, local skills, we can see that for young people who normally have to get out, to get on is to get out, they can see that there is the possibility of doing something in their own community. And this is a very considerable strength. We have another two years to run. We've been running about three years. Two years certainly in the first instance. And we'll, be, we'll be reviewing the situation at the end of that two years. And we have to think about uh, um, where exactly we go in the next two years and possibly afterwards. In the Western Isles, for example, where the community corporates have been longer established, we'll have to think about building on the joint strengths for things like marketing, design, perhaps even credit one day. I think the future does lie in continued cooperation, both within the community and w between the communities. We have seven cooperatives functioning at the moment. We must see these Kahoman coming together and at this stage, we have informal association. We would like to see possibly a federation. There's a great deal of training work that does require to be done because we still have to persuade people, not necessarily persuade, but assist people to work fully within the cooperative model. And at the end of the day, we need to provide some form of central services for community cooperatives. And this will probably be through a federation. The scheme is still in its infancy and unproven, but it's undoubtedly relevant to the needs of these island communities. Might the idea be applicable elsewhere? We asked the Professor of Social Administration at Lancaster University, Roger Hadley. The first site, the scope for community cooperatives of the kind that have been developed in the Western Isles, in the country as a whole, might look pretty small. One of the most distinctive features of the cooperatives in the Western Isles is that they are based on existing communities and communities where people are well aware that they hang together, they sink or swim together. Looking on the mainland at the large industrial conurbations, there's less evidence of community of that kind. And yet, as the recession bites and as people become more and more aware of their common problems, it's quite possible that they may begin to think of common solutions 
and that the community cooperative could find a place in the inner city as well as in the remote Hebridean village. I believe the scheme can be adapted and used in other places. What is needed is what we've done here and another place in the Western Isles to look at the needs of the community. That's what it's all about. Uh, and then the scheme can be chopped up, cut about, changed around to do whatever, whatever you want with it. It's the ideas that matter, not so much the people behind it or, or what they are. If it's, a ben a benefit, if it's going to bring a benefit or a service to the community or provide employment, if that's your objective, then it can be used anywhere, anywhere in the country. We can't think of the island now without the Cohoman. The Cohoman is so integral to the island. It is, it is the island really, because the, the island is still the shareholders. So you can't separate the two. It's not a boon, a share. Never. Full of shares, I can see the boon, sir. It's not a mob, sir. Nu <laughs> <laughs> Mae dwneudus yn gilioron stoc na bwy a'n y gefishgau. Sgwnach ac asig beg y ddwriofyd le siwan agos yn hyd. Mae Mission Steering Committee 1979 agos hwyrs yn cwytio chymwyr ag HIDB agos bach os nos ac mae agos agos hwnnw dyn i'n cymryd hwyr i'r siwan agos hwnnw dyn i'n cymryd hwyr i'r siwan agos hwnnw dyn i'n cymryd Fa cymaint y ffasiwn tonnwyl yn bwyd ac yn eich ardwyr yn sgiaid yn sgiaid yn hwnnw. Hwn sfaid y supplier sy'n nôl gym o gadd ffwyd o ffaid na hwyg. Mae'r ffer i'n meddwl sef hapas ddeg eich cwyd. Ac yn sgiaid 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 yn Ac mae jo noch tach ar gyfer mae'r bwyd ac agos gennym gen sy'n ei job cymau sgipt. Ac bat ydw, bat ydw, bat ydw, bat ydw. Ac fa ma, fa ma sôn ydw yn bwyd bwyd ma, as fa hwyl ydw yn support o'r bwyd bwyd ma, fa rili, fa ma. Cwyd yn ychwyn i'r ac mse, a eis anaw na hwb na cwyd yn ychwyn i'r ac yn ychwyn i'r ac yn ychwyn i'r ac yn ychwyn i'r ac mae'n fawr ychwawn ac yn pas ŵws as na 73 na 90s mae'r gyfi ac yn y bwy fyd o'ch yn ŵws yn alda eist ac na hanig y bwy ar wafod o'ch gosio fel nŵr rad eisiau sy'n ych a gydas o'ch a ffym o'ch 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 Gydyfa 
Kushen Taraf Gelor, Don Yagin Rugu, Sahoke, Evan Yelang, Sandava Bulochter, Don Yagin Hanikasur Hanik Su, a Yebiskai, Never Hailen Tenyak and Yil Gahi, Ektoshok Nunokutan. I was used to being able to, if you needed something, just nip out, go to the you know, the, the corner shop and get whatever you needed if you ran out of it. So um, I had to get a, a bit more organised and, you know, it took a while to get used to that milk might only come twice a week. So you had to then make sure you had enough. I mean, if you didn't, you had to you know, just do without. So um, things like that were, it took a bit of getting used to, but I... I I'm fairly adaptable, so I did get used to it, and you know, I mean, I made do. I mean, there were things I remember um, when I first came that, um, you know, if if someone was coming to visit me, you know, for my family, I would give a shopping list for them to bring the things that I I missed or the things that I, you know, I, I wanted and couldn't get here, and or sometimes I I would even ask my mother to post things to me, um, but I mean. Now nowadays you can get almost everything, and if you can't get it here, you can you know get it via the internet. So I mean things like that. It's changed beyond belief. Bane Helen and Riaf a kud erapse an embatichin pege, an an eban er san shuv avistjoch, ach mar charapachin evichin skun doyele a fine bu ospete. Nada <laughs> I kushin a lesser of began, never hoshi, ashik ud harabatan, get about Quarame has a cuckoo walk a gammon. That kushin of has got to the get the Gileo Gun here is Sulam Hinkman, Kamushin, about Elang and Ele Haiku Pipas, Marava Hirstus. Mewweis, Erna Reisner, Archer and Vashin, Clan Kamushin, the Horshik near the Hilling and Vashin, the Gol Shears. I can mention Horshishin at Stree, Gulacha, the Son Kausat, Van Vashin of Fahin, Jeder Karcher or Jilang at all, Horshin the Stree Son of Kausat, I was Harshin Hing Fudistan as Nuas at Bath Harwa Fudistigin, but scalped by his. Bernere, I can now know about scalp by a shoe drug at Spa Bernere, a dearie cows at I was a becunum, my vein, my nuker than a shin. Can you hear the sky back the Mediga de Lister, who was scalp by a drug at Snorson, Hanik Tulit, the etiquette as a renewal that either hoon, Maravaki, the canal, Hanik dedicate the machine at Fat, a scotch at Jeha, Copernere. Or about some banner, a hand was to the cool snahead of the Asha cool snahead. I said, Chef Bully Gudder, the Vashin to Yedishkaya Canaum, Fon Vashin Fahin, Jelan Yafas, a Kianic. Ah, as J. Immer Kanyu, Augustanyu, San Hanik Neoch, a vassal to be fehu fat Leonachan. But a horle at Arak at the Hut Machanu Kausat, at the Irishkai, Agis Ustijes. Kashma Miss Mirka Kornak as a house on a Hulton Yalaha, some Miss Mirka Kornak on a Hulton Yalaha, my UAP is in a fair cash or Saturday, Tolerus Nose, Garak, the Mikari Mushroom. Russian Tangal and Corn, just the Galeo Rune Yelish, and the Wheel Parliament, Chavakina Canaum, Callum Donlough, Kahari, Alistair Norris and Ahains, Medunia Corn and Yelan, Stewart Hip Technic, Muruk and Morrocks, Alec Donlough, and Hernan Fedahon, like a noun. 
Rint Tunje is in Uitskele Oudele, Fim Migra, Rint Tunje is in de Patring at Striemoor, als je met Tunje niet is, ga je zonder kousen wijn. Hij is Fim zijn natuurlijk niet meer goed bij, maar hij is in de Kraven heen, ga nog eens in de kousen, de chance aan Piet, natuurlijk die Piet verliezen wil. Ach, hij is een maal loer, goed, ik heb een opkeuring met de Tunje, ga je kalm dan, ga je wijzen naar wat hoe dat ook dat je. Falmatch, en ik vind het zo dat je nog op de wand op het gemaakt hebt. Ik heb het goed gezien, 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 ik Kost Shia Melano, Horskira Klog, a Hauser, Sichetchen, Da Wiele. Ich Kors Miele Egatjan, Rain for Edischkeit, Kobutak, and a Tedhorisch in Nuisch Jess. Get the Jemerin Hedevish Aschke Hinko Krieg. Maar hoe het in je vecht in de boer nog gewoon? Karen we weer achter zo, kunnen we krachtig en de waan in hietje nog klaar aan me. Ben je gaan naar Chevermoor? Chevermoor zijn hoe het in je is nu in. Waar zijn goed bij elkaar? Maar je moet nog even wat alle haken daar weer zien krijgen. Oh, ga ik maar weer. Hij <laughs> Bij een breakfast, de Hulle Gian machine. Als is daar willen ze hun, en ik en daar hun gaan ze vriegelen. Als is karm, ik moet je het eerst kijken, ik kan ook er zo'n hier van Ach, bekken we eens een eeuw, kus een vaag het korum, schoon, kusur, holoch, en waar ze werd, en de huis er uur. Schön. Is ook Kovak, maar waar Karim Koshok kijkt, baat aan. Waar je achter je kan huis nog. Ach en nu ha dragen elle het mondje het edische. Ha en na de kleines en skol en de godschieske ochkner, en we zijn echt al van kunduni, gaat het juist uit de skol uur gaan de brek als kwe. Ha, allemaal mooi. De hele tijd als ik hier sta, dan is mijn jongen de school uit zo aan het doorgaan. Hij is misschien zo dat hij kan het spelen. Hij is nu hij is niet bij mij vijf. Ik ga ook gewoon even zo uit te gaan. Ik ga het ons ook misschien wel. Ik ga het spelen waar ik ga. Ik ga het maken om het ook. Ik ga het zo zo voelen, maar het feit is ook op het gegeven. Hij is nu zo'n jongen. Ik ga het allemaal. Het is ik al eerst doen. Ik ga geil. Edeske is skolle sjo, eis gegeile tjun, eis nach bi is skoll. En anna heo, tullig, eis han jyl tunje son tjun hat, so nach wel nachgehene, wie edenotschug, ans anilen nachgehene. 
Gelle <laughs> She actually saw this to I was Hannah Scullin on the hill, saw this to saw this to. Ha Koyushnok Kirvachurvish, a tenanish to find Bornok, a garrison coppermen, Evishkai, put the Hakyarak shears at Koskishan Shul, Gabu, Nahalinish, a pick and minachin of Fawa. Like Mishamo was a shock on a zoo, like Vernamo on a zoo, on the case minachin. But we used to come in, she was in the Sheikh Minachin. Ach, na bein tal galop is ke, we hadden iets minder te noten dan. Koju, koju. Maar goed, je paard was geen reis, je na hef was ke heen en je hoofd stoeit weer niet aan zeggen. Alles, aan je mekras, pas koju is te groen weer gehaald. Alles, aan de mekras, nee, het van zoo, aan je vier en een half uur. Dus het kunt zo pijn je is vier uur. Ach, oh, je na twee voor mij gunje, koju, koju. Alles haas, de leert. Ach, ik was te gaan, ja, zeven keer met je te gaan, stel nog van een zoek, als ik aan de weer spreek. Ach, van een week, maar je in een hand naar koppen, ja, dat gaf je eerst een stuntje aan het hoofd, maar goed. Maar we dachten, je wat goed daar, ik wil je het kan heel goed. Navianok de Boren has captured Fjörg Evishkai, Signachel Kumis Schul van Bu, Shavibber Shahfir Wolfor. Can you say some Chigan Shina sing in Isha? Just matter, I could it in your cup, it's well, I'm put a smooth and a new yoke, I had to cup it. I put it at Shinahosh and Bu. I was a bus as you want Chincha Marsh, I was just doing. I was hat. Catorzhenhus, <laughs> Mas <laughs> We came over by a fishing boat actually from from Mali, and uh, with all the goodies on board, and and that was in April 2000. And it was very shortly after that that the well, the, yeah, I think 2000, the, the 2001, the the, the um, causeway was finished. And that's when I really started on the bus, uh, driving the bus as a volunteer driver, and have continued ever since. Right. I would find it very uh, difficult to adjust to life back on the mainland. Um, I mean, here is, there's no crime. Uh, you don't have to watch your back all the time. Um, 
is, and the children have an incredible life here. They they uh, they have the freedom to run around as children ch children do. Um, things get left here and there, toys and so on and so forth, cards, uh, credit cards in the bus. Nobody pinches anything. Um, it's just a wonderful way of life. Me bod hesoch yn y geolthwch gyfa gymwyr y sas os y prosiect y gynnyd hosioch, agos hwyd edysgau taeth agos arag y ddwyrgo ers o'n yn cochwm yn y streoch ych. Ys yw'n eich cwtwch ag y gynnau'n fwy'n fwy'n stwyddi agos slo ag yn ielaith, chad eich cochwm yn edysgau a ddydych o syrf ochr sahan yw. Ac yw'n i'n naill gyn hyrro wyth ydy ach, ach yn canon yn eirysg gyn, i'r ein bic fyr y hwrt o'r rwg agos ac dwi'n i'n tiach fy peth gyn hyrro lle i mawn yn ffwrn o ddim sy'n ac dwi'n i'n tiach yn ddia ni. Lwys yn dach to'r taith, fy taith gydiawr awn, a sy'n chi'n allan gyd hyn, sy'n bwysyn i'n ddia ni. Agos ffordd o dwi'n i'n gwaith o ein rwtigyn gyda sy'n ŵr yn tan ffw, a dwi'n i'n uans o'ch ddeg ar rwtigyn i'n ddia ni. Fa ffeim y to'r o bydlesoch chi, ach fa hwyd yn i'r y fan sas y prosiect ceintioch gyn jeglo. Y daith gwaith o'ch wlad yw'r fa, ach am sylwain gyn, fa daith sy'n yw'r reid ychyd yn ein, fa ffeim môr awn, ac sy'n yw'r dwi'n i'r faith di, ac sy'n am sylwain gyn yw'r hwc yn y dwi'n i'r cael haif, ac sy'n hwn y gyd gyburu gai rwt y gyn i ddiannu. Le taith gai fo'n bod leisig yn y geol bach, fo'n ffyn, fa hwn y gyd gygag rwt y ddiannu. Ac ys fi ag at y rwy bwyd yn yn ŵr yn tiach ddeng yn ymwneud yn droi sy'n tos stwg am yw'n nielain ag ys gach lyth sy'n hohoed. Ac ys fe sy'n ychydig o'n uan ys o'ch ma, ac ys mo sy'n fa beg an misniach gach gyda gynnobrych i'r gochwm yn, ac ys sy'n hwc dwi'n i'r cael yw. Caro ffordd y gynnawn gymaith lehyd strehyn telefysyn na chwydwch y gan y helanen, sa'n dy talfa ddwg tŵrish a sgach ciarn i gan tŵr. Fa me sfeud yn gyda cros gyda mach sŵn yn chaniafan yn yw yn y fa gaeth, nes fad coed y ffeig y dŵn, fa me cwyndio. Y chopia agos cho alen agus cho o tima na chanes mi cho siwalte agus cho tharanych sa na hilay agus ba yedag hau hwk mi hyn gyrhoedd gyma tharanych cwtwch as na dylan rwy'n ad ffyr i wopin ma na hewl ad ffyr sy'n gymi osna noch Dwi'n dweud fad ga fa grongo chi'n y mach, fa gyd o'ch yma, fa to'r gwyn yw chi'n chi'n ei ddyna i'n lwys na hos i'ch ua fa seins. A bydd tyg sy'n gyrwad ydyr lep yn ein sydd sy'n siawns, gyrwad ydyr car i chi'n ein i'r bati yn asyl sy'n sy'n. Gymi osyn o'ch fad y car gyd o'ch yw hyd o'ch yw. Agos, wael, dyn sy'n byd o'n asyl yn ei ddyna i'n ei ddyna i'n ei ddyna i'n ei ddyna i'n ei ddyna Adwch yn gyrru bonus môr a han ma yw drwy hyd y ffat y dŵr. Y gyrru eim ydw fi gael eis mae'r ei hygau hyn a rwt yn tarain eich eil y trym eich yn eil 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 gael eich byr drwy hyd. So, a hamen sŵr ydw ni a ffeim. Caws yr ŵr, hanig syrraf a siwr. Asig, y rwy a dyr erysgau ag y sbarau. Sio yn cyiad mwy eddig a dyr na helanen. O elan fiawn yr ai eich tŵr, gybarau eich dres. Hanyl y syfadwch chi'n ymwyl o'ch yn ys. Ag ys hacor yma nawn bôn o'ch gain, bod na gyfer sy'n hag gach elan y tarag si. Lehyd cor yma'n gan o'i cri cynnwch ydych eile ers o'n fas bôs. Fa 
Mae cytrymwch gymwch corym yn cosni oedd yn tafwm do Ielanig. Agus, na mwysg, hwyrdd olanig yn Ielan, corym began arag i chychos na chai pe. Mi hynt mewn rhan yn ffein tolch gwyn achos y bwys yn ffein obydd jysarni agos rhan o lai'n syrra, ffat o flyna, sa'n sy'n y torch edrych y twyn, sa'n sy'n mawr na dyn iawn ochr eisiau. Slaad yw hadd ydyf obydd ein agos hama adre, ddych o ffasgorn, ddys obydd gwyn. Sa sy'n cynnig chi byd tor dyn i ffyr un drin achos y bwys y cwyn sy'n tor stori yn ys. Sia ar y ffyrdd fawr hwn, sa mi'n ffein tol yr asio. Chyro o'r gawr, sydd ac yn mi'n ffeim agom sy'n nid yw'n ille yn ein has ysgol pwydwch yn y hostel hwys yn lian o'r gwaith fath o jechyn. Sa chyb yn yw'n ein iachu. Sa mi'n ffeim gwych sy'n cymaint ydyw yw'n ffeim gyharaj sy'n gewr i'n ydych â dyrrach ys a ffwyr. Sa ma yn iachu. Ffiws mae'n hasio yn ydyw fys ys o'n ŵr. Chyb yn ffeim gwych sy'n Sy'n y does y sier hon gwyn i'r dras. Diachgu yn cochwmwn oedd ymwg prosiect tarn y blion o chyn, le hyd conydd yr eich do ieus gafyn. Ach, hanny gyfwyn stwyddi gwyf colwni, gwyn bod gan y byfwn o'ch gole, taith gychymal dri gan y dri prosiect yn ffalu. Sy'n bwg yw'r bariad, nes i gysiwn mwy rhaid ag 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 rôl bwg, fa lygael mwy stwyddi, lygael mwy rhaid ffas yn o'r hyn, ddwch yw, Agus i mwy hwlt yn ei gwaith o gwyst, agus chor o awmach bat o asig ag 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 ar o car cfferi ac yn iawn mwy nŵr hynod. So fa cyma, tu ddeis, mae fa drawch i jam hanna i pa mŵw, ydys, fa bwg cyma, fi ydych, agus sy'n wrth pa, sy'n wrth pa ddwn i gyfeir i asgyn mwy hwlt yn hyd ar, os yn hyd gwaith o mwy nŵr hynod. Sy'n mynd dyn i fi cael trig siodd ar, mys mi'n, fa chod dyddyf, Rwy'n tybi ein gan ieira i'n ffwrdd, agos... ...chorol... ...wel, gwyddo'n rhaid cymaint dŵr cwtioch. Ha mi'n ffwrdd ystyr rwy'n tybi a dŵn i'n ieira i'n ieira i'n ieira i'n ieira. Rwy'n tybi fa... ...fa sy'n tywyn i'n ieira 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 i'n Dyn ni'n ddau i chi'n gan fwy a leid y iefyr stwy a sy'n fwy. Mae'n mynd i chi'n gadael... Fawr achos hynna mynd... Mae'n cros ni'n am cwtioch. A dwi eich mân yw'n 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 Han jy lawn o'ch y bwy hyns o bydd na niysgad yn fob yn ymys rwyt yn mwysyn o'ch gennys i eiddysg gai a ys chwmsh yn ddysg y sy'n o'ch a mys mwyn yna bydd mynd yn ffolaf yma achos to'ch chi fydd cian o'ch chi hwyr niens rwyt yn dol siys a do'ch yn ach bydd mynd yn chosfyd o fyth ach a ys cwtioch yn y dwynia y dolg yn fwy fan y bwy wedyn y dwynia hawn so clechga na caila a eis ein mwysig lad son o chawd. So, wrth un i adach leach. A mae doch os gwgw y gerain beo, agos gwlwrig ar bai beo, nid mae gwyd yn ysgyn eich. Ci a dwi'n i fi bwyd chi. Mae'n agroch y gopr chi ddra a sydd yn y gyfan sy'n a ha. Ha'n eich spilwg beic am ei ha'n eich gawsa yn doswch. A ha'n sy'n ha'n eich ne faint yn cyfeil a ffas i yna. Na siar, ach, mae'r rhaint yn Dwi'n ei dreia rai a'ch bieg y dreia sawm am y modog. Gwyd yn eich ac dwi'n ei dreia eich gael ffat y beth. At ys cynnyr ym faesion i chi a chyn ni dar o deli i anw. Se teyn ein, teyn cron i son i tost wrth turis ys trach. Se yn y BNB sy leig. A ys ha cyn ym chosgyn er ag ydych da hwfl o'ch war o'ch a mis mwyn gyfer y daun haas a diolch o'ch o'n mynd ach at fy harod harod nos o'r na yn y doi ach harod gyrs yn awn at fy ffarad ffasgwyr sy'n fa ffigwyd fa siart at ydy i anw lo Rwy'r dde ddefaith sy'n i fi ach yn i un o fa ddwy fôr ac yn y peichan gensi yn i osgach ac wrth i anw yn y neud ysgeu Rwy'r dde 
Ken sin kan maak en aantal als je kan maak prijs hebt, kies lekker nangsje. Als je kriegen kan dat get er waar waar marke jaren, of al mishand koor aan aan de lochtbeurstel, weet je, ik heb nog ach had al niet doen je niet vallen, ik had dat te fijn zoals dat die had al prijs en naam ik 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 is was je is nu je eigen naam te weet dat je marke je nille een ik is prijs en naar die aar een ik is aan die onze tonen te groen zijn, kan wel het haast, dat je nu een veel haast als een heel aan, ik is aan die kent zijn, een pech en eerst die haast, een tal voor je bloed. Zij ziet het doen, maar er op de weg koper voor je mooi zoon, ja, een nederigheid. Ik is, wanneer je gewoon een feen saaie voor een maasje krijgt, oor men gaat er weer een maasje krijgt, oor men wil geen jaar, jaar weer in de lood, ik ga geen jaar niet zien, maar toen je koper voor het taal, ik is haar, vind me daar, Ik heb een massa goprik met een kale kruidig voor de goprik gekomen in de eerste tijd. Maar het doen aan andere, ik heb een zon op de beer gaat je aan of niet aan. Haar vader zorg ik wel gekomen in de eerste tijd of zere wat ik haar niet bleef nog in. Het had een zere was reëerd nog de wensen in je land, ik is niet heel aan in mijn koorst. Het hoort gauwers nog in die gele. Er is het gielp vriesjolle goeder bouwen dan na je nog. Ha, boom, sorry, je akin. Er is ha, hulusjan, al na hou, gieri. Ha, thuis, ha, bier, ha, ritusjone. Janus <laughs> Dansig aan een um, eerst. En maar we vroeg aan eerst kijken zijn. Voelt u het dal absen bij maar zussen veen in kursten. Ach, aan Glasgow gaan nu die. 